concerns about something called zombie deer disease, and it's affecting deer in more than 20 states, including some that border Alabama. CBS 42 News reporter Connie Gasquey live in studio with more on why there are concerns. Connie? Well, guys, as you mentioned, people are calling it zombie deer disease because it affects the deer's brains and causes abnormal behavior, but its real name is chronic wasting disease, and it's actually been around for a long time. It has not reached Alabama yet, so that's good news, but infected deer have been reported in Mississippi and Tennessee. The disease causes deer to become emaciated. It's always fatal, but before the deer die, they often wander aimlessly, walk in circles, sometimes act tame toward humans, and they can exhibit a number of other unusual symptoms as well. They might have droopy ears, or you know, they might be stumbling, or they might um, uh, lose their balance and stumble and fall. You know, if you start seeing signs like that, then you know that that deer might have it. Wildlife experts say deer can display those symptoms due to other illnesses as well, but it's important to report any deer you see that exhibits this type of behavior. I'll have more details about the disease in the next half hour, including what's being done to prevent the spread to deer here in Alabama. Guys, back to you.